Today I have this piece of cardboard box. It was white and I have two mini tobacco wall baskets. You can find both of them at Dollar General. And I'm gonna trace them onto my cardboard and cut them out. Again, the mini tobacco wall baskets can be found at Dollar General. I believe they were three and two dollars. Next, I'm going to take the two cut pieces of cardboard and a Gen foam brush, and I'm going to apply two coats of some Wise Owl white primer. I want to keep these white, so I'm just going to stick with the primer. You could pick any color of your choice. And I have this Spanish moss. You can get a bag of this right from the Dollar Tree, and I'm going to spread it out so that it covers the cardboard but I do not want full coverage. It's okay for some of the white to pop through. I'm adhering everything with some hot glue. And then I'm gonna place some hot glue along the edge of the tobacco basket and I'm gonna place it onto the cardboard so that we're putting a back onto the basket. And I'm gonna repeat the same exact thing for the mini one. Again, all you need is a very small amount of hot glue. You could place your Spanish moss on top of that. And then I'm gonna go around the outside of the tobacco wall basket and place the cardboard, adhering it with the hot glue. Next, I have this wood dowel. I cut it in half and I'm gonna stick it on the back side. And this is going to be the stem of my pumpkin. You can cut the second one a little smaller and I'm adhering that to the back of the cardboard with hot glue. I found this little bundle of leaves from the Dollar Tree as well and I'm going to be using two leaves on the larger basket and I'll glue those together. And I have this cord. It's like a brown cord, but it's wired. I'm gonna wrap it around the dowel, tie a little knot, and then I'm going to wrap it around a pencil or a marker to get a little twirl in it. And then I'll glue my leaves onto the wood dowel. And just to hide where the two leaves meet, I just glued on this little piece from the bundle we bought from Dollar Tree. And now you can really decorate this however you want. You can add words to it. I'm gonna glue this little buffalo check bow to the top right corner. And I'm pretty much going to repeat the same exact thing with the smaller one, but I did decide just to do one leaf on the smaller basket. I believe I got this cord from Hobby Lobby. It's really nice. You could just bend it to really any shape that you want. And then I'll finish this basket off with a leaf and a buffalo plaid bow as well. And there you go. Now you have these really cute, easy pumpkin shelf sitters. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Paint products, tissue paper, transfers, and mesh stencils can all be found on our webpage at chalkitupfancy.com. And don't forget, you can also check out other tutorials over on our webpage. Have a great day.